Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Blitzball Champ is back here with a brand new video. And check it out. We're going to do another unboxing video. Something I haven't done in a long while. It's, it's been a good while since I've done one of these. But the perfect time has come. So what do I have for you tonight? Well, feast your eyes. This is the newly released, as of yesterday, March 31st of 2020, the new Persona 5 Royal Phantom Thieves Edition for the PlayStation 4. Now, for those that have followed me for a long time, I actually did an unboxing video for uh, the original Persona 5 that came out a, a few years ago. So, um... It's good to be back here with this brand new uh, updated version, um, pretty much a retelling of the story with a lot of new features, uh, new palaces, uh, new characters, a whole lot of stuff to really um, experience once again. So for all those that have played Persona 5, I definitely encourage uh, to pick this up as well, um, as they assure that it's and a whole entire new experience. And I, I look forward to um, eventually getting a chance to go through this while um, the eventual Final Fantasy VII Remake uh, isn't keeping me company. But we'll see what happens. But yeah, um, I had gotten the um, Phantom Thieves edition of this game. Um, I actually pre-ordered it as soon as it became available. Um, I originally uh, got this from uh, got it from GameStop. Uh, shout outs to um, my good friends Rob Potchak and Mark Anderson. Um, but yeah, this is the this is the front. It's a really cool animation. Uh, here's here's a side view, and then here is the back. Um, I do apologize in advance for the glare, um, as I have my com computer monitor on. And then, and pretty much both both sides, both side views are, are pretty much the same. But, um, reading what this says uh, that this is supposed to come with on the front um, is the Joker mask with stand, steel book, soundtrack, art book collector's box, and a dynamic PS4 theme. So, yeah, without further ado, let's, let's open it. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna start off from the top here. Okay, let's see if I can just rip through most of this. Yeah, here we go. Oh, and by the way, feast your eyes on the Faye Valentine Cowboy Bebop shirt, my all-time favorite anime. I have so many Cowboy Bebop shirts, it's not even funny. And I played the mess out of this game from start to finish. Um, this was pretty much my... Um, was it 2018, 2017 or 2018 uh, game of the year. And it's easily in my top five favorite RPGs of all time. All right. Pull this off. And, oh, let's, let's take a look at, let's take a look at this case. Oh, that's pretty neat. You know, it's got Joker in the middle. I see. I see the new character. One of the new characters is on there, and that's a that's a pretty it's a pretty cool front. And then let's see. On the side, you got Phantom Thieves Edition Persona Five Royal. Um, and oh, this is the back kind of kind of funky looking with a whole bunch of the Persona cards on there. But um, yeah, let's let's open it up. Okay, sit this right over here so I don't make too much of a mess. 
All righty. Ooh. So here's the steelbook edition of the of the game. I'm gonna take that right out. So um, yeah, it's the game itself. Take the case off. It's you know there's the steel book. Got Joker on the front. And that's the back of the steel case. It's got everybody else on there. All right, let's see what else we got. Oh, and here's the the soundtrack disc it came with. So Persona 5 Royal, the soundtrack. Um, it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten tracks on here. So it's a it's a little mini soundtrack, so that's um, that's the track list right there. Um, looks like all new songs, so um, definitely looking forward to checking this out. So should be cool. So, soundtrack disc. I always forget to turn off my phone. Excuse me for a moment. Here we go. All right, let's continue. Open this up. Ooh, nice little cover there. Oh, here's the fun part. The art book. Yeah, let's check out the art book. It's covering there. Yeah, I'll just kind of flip it like this. Okay. Here's the Persona 5 Royal art book. I, I like that art book cover. It's really cool. And there's the bat. Persona 5. Are royal. Uh, let's let's open it up. Let's let's see some of the the art inside. Okay. Oh, fair warning. Apparently, this this book does contain some 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 spoilers. So I'll just only show a few. So it's the protagonist. The usual protagonist as usual. Um, and I'll show, I'll show one more. There you go. Ryuji Sakamoto. A lot of people are familiar. Oh yeah. It's a nice little, nice little art book. Anyway, put that right there. And, oh, what do we have here? Let's see what we got here. Oh, this is a... It's a big box here. I'll take I'll take this out. And oh, okay. Let's see what, what's inside here. Okay. Oh, it's the mask. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my goodness! Hold on, hold on. I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to break it or anything. But look at that! That's the mask. That's Joker's mask. Look at that! And it comes with a, comes with a strap. I think this is a strap. Yeah, it's a strap, mask strap. But look at that! That is so cool. That is really cool. And then. Ooh, what do we have here in this bubble wrap? This must be the. Ooh, this might be the um, the mask stand. Yeah, so it has this has this part on there, um, which I guess it kind of rests in that slit, or maybe maybe this part does. I'm kind of curious as the um, how the stand works. Okay. Um, Hmm. There's this piece. Uh, I guess. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it goes in like that, or or maybe. Oh, okay. Or oh, maybe it kind of lays lays a certain way. Like maybe like this. Yeah, I think it rests a certain way, and then I just 
fit it on on there. Is this okay? Maybe the um, hmm. I don't know actually. Oh, oh, okay. I figured it out. So it kind of it goes like that. Yeah, that's how it works. Okay. That's cool. That's really cool. I like it. That's a that's a nice little stand. A little basket stand. And and the material like the material seems legit. Yeah, the the material's legit. I mean, part of me kind of wants to kind of wants to try it on. See if I can yeah, I can, I can work the, well, hmm. Yeah, it might take a, it might take a, a minute for me to, hmm, to work this. Yeah, I don't know. I have to, I have to make another video with me wearing this, because I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of curious. I have to figure out how this, how this goes on here. But, uh. But yeah, that's, that's everything. Yeah, that's everything. Um, but yeah. yeah, let me move the camera up so you can see me. Yeah, but uh, wow, pretty cool, pretty cool collector's set. Really cool mask, steel book, um, art book. And I'm guessing inside the game case is how I get the dynamic theme. But, uh, yeah. Cool. Soundtrack. Can't wait to plug that into my, to my iTunes. And, uh, yeah. I'm very, I'm very pleased. Very, very pleased. So, um, good job, Atlas. Really good job. And, um, yeah. I look forward to eventually really diving into this game but thankfully i um it's here it's out so um if it's anything like the original persona 5 i'm going to enjoy it very very much anyway um for those of y'all that have uh already gotten it and started playing uh what do y'all think so far do you like it uh do y'all feel that it's better than the original do y'all think it's pretty much the same uh let me know your thoughts um Try not to s spoil anything, though. But, um, yeah, let me know what your comments, thoughts, opinions, the whole kid kaboo. But, anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. This is Blitzball Champ signing off. Y'all have a blessed day. Peace.